So happy Sunday. Um, for those of you on the East Coast, it looks amazing out. I don't know if it's warm or not, but it looks nice for a change. Um, it appears as though spring is actually on its way. And I know we had a full moon earlier this week, so a lot of exciting things happening. Okay, everybody, um, you know, sit up straight. You know, I learned this from a yoga instructor. We have, uh, you know, two little bones in our, in our tailbone. So sit up straight, make sure you can feel both bones sitting on that chair or laying down, whoever you're gonna do it. Uh, get your posture going. So we're gonna do probably about a 20 minute uh, Reiki session, and then uh, we'll open it up and see uh, what everybody's experiences are. Okay, sit up and close your eyes. Deep inhale, exhale. Dear Mother, Father, God, Divine Infinite Spirit, source of all that is, we ask to be connected to you, to our higher self, and to the higher self of all those that we love, all of those that we place in our Reiki circle for healing, plus all persons, places, or things that are important to us, and also those that need healing. And we thank the angels, archangels, ascended masters, Reiki masters for this group healing, especially Master Jesus, Master Buddha, Master Katumi, Saint Francis, Saint Germain, Saint Raphael, Saint Gabriel, Saint Michael, the Blessed Mother, the Divine Feminine, Mary Magdalene, Moses, Metatron, Mount Kizida, Muhammad, and Kuan Yin. We ask that whatever comes to us comes in for our highest good. We are a clear channel of light for Metatron and his healing angels so that we may receive the highest light for our healing. We know that when we have two or more of our circle gathered, it is that number of people to the power of those people. So it looks like we have six or seven to the power of seven, which just puts us somewhere in 300,000 range. So we are very, very powerful together. And our healing will also be much greater. We also want to thank all the beings and ancestors for helping us with this healing and with our path. So envision the white gold light coming into your crown chakra, going down into the center of the earth and coming back up through our feet. The energy flows through you and connects you to God, to your higher self and to all, all ascended masters, ancestors, and all the healing angels. Now imagine that you are drawing your Reiki symbols on your palm. Feel the feeling of your finger as it touches your left palm. Choku Rei, Choku Rei, Choku Rei. Say hey key, say hey key, say hey key. Now you are at the place where you're gonna do your best healing. So imagine whoever you're going to help, friends, loved ones, neighbors, your pets. Envision that golden healing light flowing into them as you use each one of your Reiki tools. 
chopping, the slicing, the taffy pull. All right, so I'm gonna go quiet for a little bit so you can work on whoever it is you're gonna work on.
Okay, whoever you're working on, start wrapping it up. Make sure you seal them up. Okay, do the infinity sign and seal up whoever you're working on. And then start bringing yourself back out slowly. And as you're coming back out, start feeling yourself more energized. Going down to this level energizes you and you feel great. Make sure you're all smiling because you're doing wonderful work. So open your eyes, get a good stretch in. Everybody back? So let's go around. I'm gonna call your name and let's share whatever you were feeling, if you were feeling anything, if you saw anything, your experience. Um, if you don't wanna share, then certainly let me know. So let's start with Andrea. Where are you? I'm right here. Hi, hi, Rose. Thank you so much. Um, <clears throat> I um, worked on myself for some healing and some health issues, and I just felt I so peaceful. And I listened to like healing music in the background too, Tibetan bowls, you know. Um, and it's just so, it's so relaxing, but, um, just what I needed. Usually I'm focusing on some other people, but I was just, I felt like I was, you know, drawn to work on myself and I, I feel very energized and very calm and centered. And I just want to say, thank you. You just, wow. You look like you're beaming. You're smiling. Oh, good. Your eyes are smiling. <laughs> yeah. You must feel yeah. good. I, I do feel good. I feel very, very refreshed. So thank you. <laughs> Great, thanks. Okay, Ashley. Hi, um, thank hey. you. I was sending healing to my mother who just got out of a major heart surgery on Friday. And so I've been going back and forth to the hospital. Um, and so, yeah, I was picking up just, I feel like different, um, sin, like getting different perceptions or images of the state that she's in now, just sort of exhausted, I think, but slowly recovering. Um, yeah, I was really just focused on um, uh, making sure that I didn't allow myself to be distracted and just 
sending healing. I got s several bit, you know, um, visions, but uh, anyway, I appreciated the space to be able to um, send healing because I think that I've been running around focused on what to do next um, and then also getting ready to go to the hospital and but to have this period of time carved out to just focus on sending healing um, that's what I would like to have so um, thanks for for um, giving this space for that yeah and Ashley you know make sure you take care of you right I mean sometimes people forget who's taking care of the person that's taking care of the person so you know I maybe if you have any time carved out, maybe look look towards inward. Take care of yourself too, honey. Thank you. Okay. Uh, Charlene. Good morning. Um, thank you for that. That's very appreciate. Hello, everyone. Um, yes, I I focused on my daughter. She's probably waiting for these results, and she, and she, her body's been. Um, her joints have been hurting quite a bit and they're not really sure. So we're waiting for the results of these tests. And I focus on her, I've been focusing on her every Sunday that well, for the last month. Um, I also, uh, I did um, energize my um, Reiki grid. So um, so I, I brought that in too, my Reiki grid. So I did energy there. So I, I, do, I do feel good myself though. And, and I'm uh, glad I was able it this morning so thank you very much appreciate it oh that's awesome that's awesome see where are we andrea ashley denise good morning i uh was focusing on my sister-in-law who's got terminal cancer and uh i was appreciating the space to work and send her healing and i just did notice uh some density in her, some uh, anxiety for sure, and mental space, which is understandable. But um, no, it's just very, very good to do. Very lovely. Good. And again, it's just the time. It's a nice thing to do. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, okay, Julie. Julie still with us? Do we lose her? Julie, if you're out there, you're on mute. No? All right, we'll come back to her. How about um, Robin? Uh, hello. Uh, hello. With everyone else, you know, thank you so much for uh, taking lead on the Reiki Share because I think this is a wonderful community and opportunity for folks to to share an uh, energetic healing session and to focus on people who need it, including ourselves. So first and foremost, thank you for that. Um, I can't always make it, so it's always a treat when I can be here. And a little rusty on some of the symbols and things, like I remember them generally, but for me, this is more about uh, the focused attention. So um, I was, I don't have anyone super close to me right now that needs healing, but I think we all know people who's dog or their daughter or their so-and-so and, and so I, I really just spent the time kind of going from the various folks who I know are going through a difficult health situation or sometimes just feeling the pain of the loss of a pet or something and so I was for me I could feel it a little through my arms and my hands and, and just felt more like of a touching of the people that I knew were um, going through difficult times right now so good thank you uh, Julie Denise. Okay. Is there anybody else? I have a um, two month old kitten here who really, really enjoyed whatever energy was going on. She just, she kept wanting to climb up here and uh, be part of it. So <laughs> I think she felt it. <laughs> okay. okay. Um, hi, it's Julie. Sorry, I'm, I I couldn't get to the mute button for whatever. Oh, reason. there you are. Uh, you, hi. So sorry, I missed the beginning. Um, 
And I just wanted to say, I'm going to, whenever I have a chance to pray, I'm going to hold everyone's families and loved ones in prayer. And I was hoping that I, I no worries, that I could uh, so hope that uh, people might keep me in their prayers this week. I'm having a surgery that I already had in January again, but it's more complicated and invasive. So I apologize for not being here, you know, earlier and not, and I'm running in and out last time. So I apologize for that, but I'll, I've been in pretty much some acute pain. So, and it's going to be a very involved surgery. So if you guys. All right, hope. Julie, I'm on it. I'm sending you, I'm going to send you a lot of healing and, um, and when's your surgery this week? It's, I have a embolism on Tuesday and a surgery on Thursday. The only thing is I know that we're not allowed to send Reiki on those days because it can affect anesthesia, anesthesia. but okay. I would healing any other days and um, any thoughts or prayers. And Got I it. know I'm going through every all so much. So when I have a chance to pray I'll send, send prayers for all as well. So thank you. What, Julie, what days did you say not to send Reiki? Tuesday. Uh, healing prayers are fine, but the Reiki is Tuesday. And I believe it's Thursday. If it changes, it, it's possible Friday, but it okay. looks like Thursday. So probably better not to do Thursday, Friday, but I will definitely be needing it after that. <laughs> and, okay. you know, Wednesday and the next couple of days. So I, I cherish this group and I thank you for your eternal support. And um, I'm grateful for you all. So thank you. Yes. Okay. Um, I'm just, I'm looking at the list really quick. Robin, Denise, Charlene. Did I miss anybody? I think we got everyone. Okay, everyone. Have an amazing day. Find time to smile and just every once in a while try and center yourself too. Because we're all going off in so many different directions and we all have a lot going on and um i know for me personally you know sometimes my family my friends can start to get me <laughs> a little amped up and wound up with things that are going on so i have to try and in order for me to help them i gotta pull it together so um have a great rest of your day great rest of your week and thank you everyone for joining thank you rose <laughs> happy easter Bye. Happy, Happy Easter, everyone.